Hello, I'm Dr. Thomas McElhoney, founder and CEO of Church Plaza, and today we are going to compare the characteristics, benefits, and costs of individual church chairs, pews, and theater seats. Since 1986, Church Plaza has sold and delivered well more than two million church chairs and tens of thousands of theater and pew seats to America's churches. We also understand church cultures, worship practices, building design, costs, and preferences. Hopefully, our experience will help you. We're going to divide our comparisons into four general seating characteristics, culture, comfort, space utilization, and cost. Choosing seating for your church is an individual and personal choice, and there are no absolute rights and wrongs, just what is best for your church. Let's begin with the cultural aspect of choosing seating for your church, and this may be a difficult topic for many congregations. Pews are beautiful, they're traditional, and can be particularly important to many. We've seen churches begin and end their review of seating choices with this topic. From a comfort perspective, pews are the least comfortable of the three seating options. No matter how nice cushioning is, straight seats and backs are not nearly as comfortable as a well-designed chair or a theater seat. As a general rule, individual theater seats can be the most comfortable seating options, but much depends upon the design and quality of the product. Some higher-end church chairs can match the comfort of many theater seats, but seat design, quality of construction, and your individual preferences will determine that. Our suggestion, if undecided between theater seats or church chairs, is to obtain a sample of each and have members of your church compare. One word of caution, be sure and test them for a period of time equal to that of your worship service. An overly soft chair won't provide the kind of support that makes for longer use comfort. Space utilization, and this topic has several perspectives. It's a generally accepted fact today among church planners that pew seating will only be used to 80% of its capacity, and that's America's desire for personal space. This 20% loss of capacity factor with pews can impact the need to build or renovate space, and that can be a significant expense. Another aspect of space utilization is the requirement to permanently affix pews and theater seating to the floor, thus limiting the use of that space. Individual chairs can be ganged together to provide a unified seating sense while also meeting fire codes, then easily disengaged from one another and conveniently moved and stacked, thus making the seating area usable for a wide variety of other applications. This utility of individual chairs versus pew and theater seating has saved thousands of churches from the need to incur building or renovation costs. Let's compare acquisition cost of each seating type on an apples to apples per seat basis. And to do so, I'm going to use comparisons of good products from known and reputable providers. The fact is, there are cheaply made products of all three kinds of seating available. And while you might find something that appears to be a bargain, if it's not from an established and reputable provider, I would be very careful. Quality individual church and sanctuary chairs will cost from $35 to $60 per chair, with an average shipping delivery cost of another $6 per chair. Assuming your congregation is willing to unwrap and place the chairs, there should be no additional fees. Pews are generally priced on a linear foot basis, but one must then convert a linear foot into practical usable seating space. And using a standard 22 to 24 inches per seat with all three seating applications, 30 years ago it was 18 inches, then the 80% usable pew capacity standard, the actual cost per usable seat with pews then is going to be in the range of $100 to $150 per seat. Theater seating also has a higher cost than individual chairs, with good seats from a reputable company running somewhere between $130 to $250 per individual seat installed. As I noted earlier, seating is a very personal choice for your church. But what I've just shared with you is why today 85% of all new church seating purchases are individual church and sanctuary chairs. I hope this information is helpful to you. Please let us know if we can be of further service to your church as you evaluate your seating needs. And if we can be of help, please know that over the years, Church Plaza has been endorsed and recommended by more than 45 national denominations, ministries, and or their publishing houses, while no other provider of church seating has received even one endorsement. America's highest quality church seating, at exceptional values and from people you can trust. Why would you go anywhere else? Blessings and Semper Fi.